37-year-old father of two, Matthew Berry, owned a small building company he ran from his tambourine mountain home. Detectives say his ex-wife made the grim discovery. She hadn't heard from him and went to check at the Talima Drive property. She is a grieving uh, lady. She, we, we feel for her. She spent quite a number of hours yesterday with detectives and uh, she's assisting us greatly. Police say there were obvious signs of violence. He was found in his living room with significant injuries to his head and upper body. Detectives canvassed the area, going door to door, speaking to neighbours. Police believe he was likely killed the day before his body was found. So we've had fingerprint experts at the address, uh, we've had blood spatter experts at the address and general forensic officers to triage and make determinations about what expertise might be required uh, to advance that crime scene. Detectives have appealed for witnesses, CCTV or dash cam footage to identify any vehicles or anyone entering this property in the past two days. If we can focus on the time on Wednesday morning, Wednesday the 28th, um, from, oh, from sunrise to, to, to sunset, that is our, our focal period. Um, but of course, um, we, will, we will be looking either side, but that, that's the time that we believe is critical to our investigation. Anyone with information should contact Crime Stoppers. Mackenzie Collahan, ABC News.